Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play We Happy Few. I'm your host, Spring at Dawn, and... We're just going to continue the main quest. I kind of looked around. Uh, most things are blocked off by a joy gate. I don't feel like taking joy and dealing with that whole fiasco. Um, so we have... We can't really explore anywhere. There's joy gates on every road. So I'm just going to head towards uh, the Garden District and do the next main quest. They even let me out. I'll say should. So don't I own the constabulary anyway? Alright, or not. Maybe it's not gonna let me out. There we go. One of these days, Gwen, I'm gonna teach you all about chemical interactions. They're so much more reliable than boys. Alright, so I'll use an atomizer to spray chemicals at our enemies. So you can craft Hallucinex in the chemical section of the crafting menu, then you can craft the Hallucinex atomizer in the weapon section of the crafting menu. Put the Hallucinex atomizer's weapon and press RT to correct, or create, correct, to create clouds of drugs that will make other people think obsessively about dogs with hilarious and violent results. Be able to unlock the other atomized recipes throughout the game. That was very easy to get to. Um, all right, well, let's change into my my new uh, clothes. All right, it's 405 meters away. Oh man, I can run. I, honestly, in a game like this, you should never restart the player because all the loot they accumulated and everything, like. Relooting isn't fun. In my opinion, like, if it's the same areas over again, and it is. I mean, we have that one new area we can uh, travel to the um, the rat home. Tiny beds in every house. Ooh, tub. Is that a new one, or is that one that we've already read? Of course, it's one we've already read in the previous one. Like, it's having new notes. It's literally the same loot again. That's not. It's not fun for anybody. The mark of Cain was to protect him. This is for the benefit None of Mr. Kai. Get that? The rabbit got into the garden. Oh. Isn't it achievement for this? Um, Sounds like. I figured out how to do it. I thought you could only do it in sort Arthur's of playthrough. Secret message. But uh, you can do it with. Uh, Pr or not prudence, uh, Sally as well. Uh, it seems. It takes 12 days to do. You have to, like, every day you get one phone call. I don't know if I'm gonna go through the trouble of doing it, especially not with Sally's playthrough. It's just about that baby to worry about. Yeah, so far, I haven't seen any side quests anywhere. Um, I'm gonna assume that there aren't any. At least so far. Which is kind of disappointing, but also kind of kind of a relief because uh, well, I'm not a big fan of Sally Boyle. I'm gonna go check this corner up here, see if uh, we pick up a side quest somewhere. All these people standing around. I know just how you feel. We've all got to stick together. Remember bread? Or do they get mad if I run here? No, they don't. Alright, I don't see any side quests this way. I mean, it keeps going. But so far, everything seems pretty side questless. Like, you would have found one by now. An Arthur's, uh, an Arthur's story. Alright, so let's just head towards uh, the Uncle Jack fans. Sorry, I am very sniffly today. Had a little bit of trouble breathing. And my wife wants to go to the gym. Can you believe that? Well, these hats never. Runny, 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 runny. So, this is the garden district. What area of the garden district is this? This is what? Maiden home, right? No, main home's up here. This is Rat Home, which again is not somewhere we've been before. So I'm curious about that. 
At least we're both in this together. Yeah, let me get in that rubble. Stay away from the ones with plague. It's a terrible way to go. Oh, let's get some uh, some of these for some medicated bomb. Yeah, I'm gonna try to avoid fighting in this uh, in her story. I'm gonna try to stealth it through if we can. Hello. Are you a friend of Uncle Jack? Of course. Who isn't? You'd be surprised. Some people seem to think that because we're out here in the Garden District, we have to abandon all pretense of civilization. We can't take joy, but that doesn't mean we can't see the world the way Uncle Jack does, right? It's just a question of concentration. Oh, yes. In fact, Uncle Jack has heard of you. He's heard of us? You oh, can't be serious. Is he going to talk to us on the TV? Oh, but we never get the new programs out here. What did he say? How do you know? Why didn't you ask him? He's coming to visit. He wants to do a live broadcast from here. He's coming here? But the place is a mess. We have to clean up. Uncle Jack's coming. Uncle Jack's coming. Uncle Jack's coming. That's the spirit. Let's show Uncle Jack just how much we love him. Did he faint from excitement? And I hear music. Hello, British craftsmanship. Increased durability of crafted weapons. Hey, let me alone. Are you kidding me? Oh man. Oh my gosh, she takes so much. Oh, I'm trapped. I'm trapped. Oh boy. Let's run. Let's run. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. Okay. Well, so much for stealth, right? I see a record over here. Is this not it? Oh, crap. Yeah, she does, like, no damage to their weapon. Oh my gosh, get out of the way, guys. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is terrible. Locked, it requires a lock pick. Run, jump. Run some more. Yeah, I understand. I mean, I'm probably gonna die here. I'm not, I'm not holding out any, uh, uh, medicated. That'll heal me for full. Actually, the regular one will probably help me for full as well. What's this? Can I, can I grab this? This is rough, man. Son of sucks. Dream. Move, person. Alright, I got I got one. Alright. Well, I think it's gotta be this. Crap, I'm gonna trap myself in here again, aren't I? Please move. This is dumb. Sabo sucks. As a person and as a playable character. I didn't check up here, did I? I should be safe over here. Of course, it needs a lockpick. So right here, I should be safe until things calm down, right? Right. Get something to drink. Um. I mean, this should do it, right? Yeah. You're not the bloody elf, are you? So get out. Fine. Run away and hide. All right, so I found one of the records. I need to find the other rare record. Also, I need to craft lockpicks if I can. Um. Oh, she probably can't do it unless she's at a workbench, can she? Or do I just not have enough? Oh, I need bobby pins. Son of a gun. Alright, well, I gotta find the other record. Is that the one that I already looted? 
This isn't your house. Yeah, tell that to my umbrella. Kiss my ass. Alright, if I can take out one of them at a time, we're in the clear. But if two of them show up, we're in a pickle. It sounds like it's coming from this house. I'll have to climb up. I'm calling the authority. Leave my friend alone. You want to play hide and seek? I do not want to play hide and seek. I want this. I want to leave. I'm out of here. This guy's gonna be hostile. Y'all ain't part of the cult. What the heck am I stuck on? Are you kidding me? Get out of the way. Jesus. I don't have enough to make a healing thing. Sounds a bit hard hearted, doesn't it, Gwen? How do I make a. I'm in combat, son of a gun. I'm not a fan of this story already. This is stupid. I'm probably gonna die before I'm out of combat because I cannot run him in this condition. Well, maybe I can. Nope, because there's more. There's freaking more, man. I'm gonna die. So aggravating. They don't have anywhere to hide. One per no, there's more than one. Son of a gun, man. I hate, I hate this. I hate the story. I hate playing as uh, Sally. For the passion, I'm gonna pick these up. I think I keep my loot if I die, right? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. I can't make any healing items. Oh, really? Oh, that's exciting, too. Another mechanic added in the second story. I'm having so much fun. This is fun. That's what this is. Stupid. Man. I just want to play as Ollie. It's a, uh, spoiler, you, the third story is Ollie. And you don't have to play stupid Sally Boyle. God. How did I live through that? Oh my goodness. Well, I know where they're at now, so I think I have my healing items back, right? Take that. Take the book. I'm calling the authority. Good morning to you. I'm not cooking for you. Good morning, dear friend. Are you ready? Chill up here until everything calms down. Is there any calm? Yeah, she's looking for me. How? How is he? Okay. This isn't your hat. I know. Let's go and I run up here, right? Let's chill over here until uh, everything blows over. This is a waste of both our time. Come out, and take your medicine.
I'm gonna explain why I don't like Sally Boyle. Because I've known a few women like Sally Boyle, where she she has a certain lifestyle, right? She sells, in this case, illegal drugs to like the constabulary and uh, all that jazz. She's very self-destructive. And then she has a child, right? So instead of straightening things out, getting a real job, doing something a little bit safer for the sake of her child, she continues her same lifestyle, saying it's all for a child, but in fact it's because it's easier to do than to change. While that might be a little unfair in some situations, for the most part, there's always room to change for the sake of your child. Um, I've, it's just it's a very self again self destructive. Uh, means of taking care of each other. It's, it's not it's not fair to the kid. And things always go wrong for him. And they're always like, why does this happen to me? It's because of the lifestyle you chose to live, instead of changing again to take care of your child, you, you maintain that same lifestyle because it's easy. It's I what you know. You're not willing to do anything for your, baby feeder for me. For your kid. It, then I wouldn't have to run back home as often to feed Gwen. Sounds a bit hard hearted, doesn't it, Gwen? But mommy's trying to save our lives. I don't know. It, it's it's like the most exasperating thing. They even show it in like TV shows all the time. The same stuff, same situations, and it never works out for him. Like, it's just it's problem after problem after problem. It's like the person never learns their lesson. Like in this case, they had a addict break into their house and discover their child. Oh, that's a pretty big deal. You know, if you weren't selling illegal drugs, that would have never happened. That I mean, might be kind of a mechanics either, but the uh Of course I can't go back in that way, can I? Three of those came out, but only one came out at the end. Battlefield. Oh Hello. Let's have a look at you, shall we? You're in tip top shape, aren't you? You were so pleased you survived. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, uh... I the put that on. That's it. I can't run through here. Joy doesn't seem to have as much of an effect on uh, the, like, outlying part of the joy that will cause you to have, like, the memory loss or lapse or whatever the heck. Doesn't seem to be as severe for Sally as I, as severe as severe for Sally either. Cannot talk. Pleasant walk. <clears throat> I feel like every road has a stupid. Well, maybe not this one. Almost every road has a uh, like a joy detector on it, which is really aggravating. Making it into your way around town. It's, there's more here than there were with a uh, when you played as Arthur. Yeah, I understand. We'll we'll be there shortly. Hopefully with some supplies. At least you walk faster than everybody else. It gives you a sense of uh, actually moving. You might want to see a doctor, ma'am. 
Oh, that's right, crap. When I'm coming this off of the afternoon. afternoon. <laughs> Son of a gun, man. Oh, this is aggravating. If I take joy now, is it gonna save me? <sighs> it's not. I'm not I'm not I can't even take this guy. Dude. Is there, even a, is there even a point in trying? My goodness gracious. So I could just talk to Lionel and it would reset everything. I'm just gonna die. I'm not gonna try. There's no surviving this. There we go. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I only am enjoy Act Two. Act Three, I might enjoy because again, you get to play as Ollie, who seemed kind of fun. Oh, a bit too bright and shiny, Sally. All right, we're back here. Yeah, make sure I'm inside by the time the joy wears off. And I can just run back to her house. I don't have to worry about it. Oh, so frustrating. So that would seem uh, Miss O'Rourke. I thought I said Mickey Rourke. Oh man. I don't know, playing this game, it kind of makes me want to play Jack and Daxter. I don't know if any of y'all remember that PlayStation 2 title. It was a fun game. It was a fun, like, platformer collector game. Like, I guess comparable to, like, Crash Bandicoot or whatever. I'm gonna probably just hide until the... ...stuff wears off. That'd probably be for the best. I just keep taking... Screw, I'm just gonna keep taking joy. Kangaroo. Sorry. I fell. Um, yeah, let's just keep taking joy. I don't care. Now you're on the right side of the door. It's Lionel. Lionel, real quick. Lionel. Lionel Johnson of the Dark Angels. It's a Warhammer 40k reference. Lionel Johnson was the Primarch of the Dark Angels chapter. No one really knows whose side he was on. I'm gonna say that he was a loyalist, even though uh, there's some speculation since he seems to have waited to see what the outcome of the Horus Heresy would be instead of actually, oops, riding to uh, the Emperor's aid. But I'm gonna say he's a loyalist. He is a knight, and he follows knight knightly virtues. But he's also supposedly the best tactician of the Primarchs. So who knows? Morning. Sally Boyle! I hope you found your Uncle Jack record. Me borrower's been pestering me. I have indeed. You're a brillo! Milk you shall have! Lionel, you're sort of handy, aren't you? Well, I do like to tinker. You'd be amazed at the state of some of these things when they come into the shop. Can't sell them if I can't fix them. I have some designs for some apparatuses. Some sort of... Uh, water feeder for, for birds? Oh, heavens no. I can't stand the crows. It's for my flowers. Mustn't over water, but I keep forgetting to water at all. <laughs> oh, of course. Uh, well, let me see what I got in the back there. I, 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 I bet I can find all the pieces sooner or later. <laughs> they, they, they never show up right away, but they always show up sooner or later. Uh, check back in a bit. In three days. Alright. What the heck am I supposed to do for three days? 
Then we go back to our house. And then I think in the next episode we'll go and explore Rat Home. Because, um... We haven't been there before. And I'm curious to see what's there. Uh, but we're going to go check on the baby real quick. Since I have to. Unless I don't have to. I'd probably ignore it. That's not what a good parent would do. So let's uh let's go check on the baby. On the child. Little Gwen Stefani. Who was like my childhood crush when I was in like uh I think middle into high school. Her and Shakira. Ooh. Well, even if the joy roy is off, I can just sprint to the house real quick. I should be fine when inside. Right? I hope so. This is a pretty intimidating looking building. What is this? No minutes to anyone ever. It's like a small fortress. See? Did not pick up that side quest? Because that's a side quest for Arthur. Uh, Next run. Time, stop after the first What's that? It's nothing. Ah, oh, of course it's a joy thing here. What was I thinking? Did I be able to just walk through here? Don't be crazy. I can't unlock my own house. Where the crap is the door at? Right. No more, Mr. Nice Guy! Oh my gosh, move, old lady. God, I hate this old lady so much. Can they come in here? Can they come in there? Please close that door. Upstairs. I'm going all the way up here. They can't come in here with the baby, can they? Oh, I can't feed her. Wait, did I not get the... Do I not have the... I have to craft the baby milk. How do I craft... Um, I don't know if I ever explained how to make baby milk, did it? Um, should I make these? I'm gonna make one of these. Uh, pure water. Uh, do I put it on the stove? Oh, you had to like heat it up or whatever for... Mm. I don't know how to make it. Uh, craft baby milk. Alright, how do I craft baby milk? I didn't even see it in the uh, options here. Yeah, I hear you, baby. I'm trying to figure out how to do this. I'm a new parent. Yeah, I've got the tin milk. How do I make the old, uh... How do I set it up for babies? Um, oh wait. There you go. Shut your face. Uh, um... I don't know how to make baby milk. It's not a craftable item. I have pure water, but you don't put water in it, do you? Again, I don't know. I'm a new parent. I haven't read a single parenting book yet. There we go. 
That's a good song. Um, yeah, I have no idea how to craft this. Do I have to go down to the uh, crafting table and do it? Or to the uh, chemistry table? Oh, baby milk. Yeah. <sighs> Gwen's got something to eat at least. There we go. Figured it out. Here we go, darling. Baby milk. You won't believe what Mummy had to do to get this for you. Well, I'll never tell you, frankly. Alright, so now I have to wait three days. Who's at the bloody door now? Alright, let's answer the, answer the door. Uh, we'll probably call it an episode very shortly. Let's go answer the door first. I feel like we haven't got a lot done. It's mostly me dying this episode, so... Sorry to bother you, ma'am. The lads is, uh, wondering if you've got any blackberry ready for him. Oh, I'm working on it. In a day or two, I hope. The lads is getting a mite twitchy, to tell you the truth. I must ask you to uh, accompany me to the station, so you can explain yourself to them precisely. Okay, guess we're going with them. I don't understand the worry. Haven't I always provided you with Blackberry? I just had a little hiccup in the lab. I'd be working on it right now, but apparently you lads are lonely. That ain't quite true though, Harm, is it? You've been seen all over town doing all sorts of things. We don't imagine that Lionel Kashir is much of a source of pharmaceutical ingredients. Oh, but there, you'd be wrong, Constable. See, I had to replace some bits of lab equipment. And you've been roaming around the Golden District doing Lord knows what. Yes, well, I, uh... Blackberry's made with herbal extracts. Why do you think it's called Blackberry? And the Victorial Memorial Camp? Two visits in the last week? I suppose them visits was for our benefit as well. Not at all. I was visiting the General. He also gets quite cross when I haven't seen him in a while. Oh, uh, so he... Uh, well, yes, yes, of course he would. Uh, right. Well, we can hardly expect Miss Boyle to ignore the General now, can we, lads? Ha! Uh, of course he would. Nonetheless, Miss Boyle, the lads have developed an appetite for your fine cooking, as it were. If they go hungry, chaos will ensue. We must insist that you devote your full and urgent attention to feeding them. Or what? Or we shall be compelled, willing or no, to provide your assistance, willing or no, to Dr. Verloc. And that won't be cheery for either of us. I guess I can't blame them for being antsy. It's not fun going off Blackberry. And if they go back on regular joy, they'll get the cramps and they won't even remember why. Thank God I'm almost done with this new batch. Alright, well we're going to call it here. In the next episode, we'll uh, keep the home fires burning. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching and I hope to see y'all in the next one.